Using a Runcam 2 as an FPV camera is nothing new. In fact, it's supplied with a lead for exactly that purpose. But I have in fact used this lead in the past, connected it up to my battery pack in the model. The Runcam 2 will accept from 5 volts to 17 volts, and as most of my models fly on 3 or 4 cells, that works for me. I have this old phono connector that I was using to connect to some other equipment at that time. But I want to repurpose this today and connect it up with a new FPV transmitter. This guy is fixed at 600 milliwatts but has the normal channel selection available, the comprehensive list of which is provided as always. Of more interest at this point is the pinouts. We have similarly an input voltage 7 to 24, so for my three or four cells that works. A ground video and audio in, a ground and an output for 5 volts, which I'm not going to be using, which is just as well because the cable only has the five connections that I've listed here. We now know what our connections are going to be. The JST power connector is already there. All I need to do is to splice into the red and black to power the transmitter and similarly remove this connection here and connect to the yellow and the blue wires. The green I'm not going to be using. Everything is wired up now here to test and I've changed the antenna out for one of these circular polarized ones which I'm wanting to try. Let's power it up now and check it with my goggles. So that should be recording now and you should be able to see the picture on my FPV goggles. So I'm recording on the DVR there and we'll compare that against the footage from the camera itself, which obviously will be in, in HD, much better quality. Of course, the idea is to actually put the transmitter inside the Runcam housing, because we won't be needing the battery. And to hold that all in place, I've 3D printed this Runcam 2 holder, which I've modified to put the hole in the back where this SMA connector is going to pass through. I have another video on how I took a couple of different designs from Thingiverse and merged them into what you see here. I'll just assemble that now. This is the mount that will go in the front of my Bixler glider. Everything is in place. All we have to do now is to pray that tomorrow we'll have a nice day to go and fly. Touch more power. Right. <laughs> Ooh, 
Landed. <laughs> wasn't watching, where are you? <laughs> In the tree here. Great. Okay. It's got to be a plus, hasn't it? Alright, stop growing. Okay, I'll see you later. See you later. Cheers, Graham. <laughs>